Quiz time, quiz, quiz time. time. It is quiz time. Andy. Yes. So you think you know Fallout 4? I do. I mean, I've made like a hundred videos about it. <laughs> so <laughs> you'd hope I would. I haven't completed it. I don't know if Mike's even finished Fallout 4. So probably not that well. Because he's right. too busy playing Forza. What's a, what's a <laughs> the car Forza. game? Yeah. I did escape from the mayor in the nude though. So. Punch him! No, run! 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 You're not running! I'm trying! Uh, run! No, 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 no. See the uncrouching? Yes. That was no, a problem. Oh, oh, God. oh run, my jeez! Specialist skills. Well, the companion I carry around with me is Nick Valentine and he's never complained before, so I take that as tacit approval of my constant nudity. Even I don't know where the Institute is, and they built me. You know, I don't want to go into my character's personal life, but me and Kate, we got a kind of a thing going on. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not going to say her though, because this is more of a general question. I think Nick, I mean, he doesn't have emotions like disgust or envy, uh, both of which would, would factor into me wandering around naked. Who's the nakedest companion? Probably Strong. You now, Strong's leader. Because he's, I mean, he's got a loincloth. Uh, so he's basically naked. So he might be like, yeah, good. Just a couple of naked bros roaming around the wasteland. So I'm, I'm going to say Strong. It was actually Kate. Was it? It was Kate. Oh. No points. Man. It's actually Kate. What? Kate, apparently, if your character is nude, she approves. You should have gone with Kate. I should have gone with Kate. I don't know why she so approves of you being naked. She's not naked. I did not know this yep. about my romantic partner in Fallout 4. Oh God, probably dog meat because like it's just, it'd be down at the level of all the business going on. This is tough because my character's always got clothes on. Probably dog meat then, I think. Let's go, pal. Who seems like they would not approve of me being naked? Piper, I would say, maybe? How would you describe your time on the inside? It's actually Hancock. Is it? Yeah. I haven't got, got Hancock. Let me tell you something. Okay, well he's got very stylish threads. So, so maybe that's why? Yeah, he's like, why aren't you wearing stylish. revolutionary duds like me? He's a ghoul. Okay. He's actually a ghoul. Oh, is um, he jealous of all the, of my, my firm non ghouly flesh? That's probably it. Dog meat actually <laughs> doesn't disapprove of anything you do because he's a dog. Ah, right. He loves everything Even you do. Even if you're a total sadist. Yeah, yeah, that's the, that's the great thing about dogs. I'm going to get naked around Hancock. What behaviour lets you build affinity with this character. One point for each correct behavior, but there, there's one in particular I'm looking for. Super mutants are brothers. Brothers share all, not own things like humans. So he's a communist. He likes fighting a lot. He's always shouting about too much talking, not enough fighting. So killing people, I'm gonna say. Okay. Um, what kind of people? Raiders. I would say bad people, killing bad people. How would I chat up? A super mutant. <laughs> they like murdering things, right? Do you just have to murder as many people as possible? Eating corpses. Oh God! Eating corpses. <laughs> I guess super mutants are into that. And he loves it when you do it. He loves apparently. it. Wow. Okay. He's Eat like corpses. Really into that. Yeah. I'm gonna give you half a point because murdering non-hostiles. He is into murder. Right. But raiders would be hostiles. Ah, okay. He's into just, just killing, just killing innocent okay. people. Wow. He seems like such a nice guy on first. I mean, I, I, I was going to go for the don't judge a book by his cover, giant ugly super mutant, pr probably a nice guy in real life. No, terrible, horrible person. <laughs> Greatest of all time. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, it's the test, isn't it? The goat test is, um, the A is probably aptitude, isn't it? The T is probably test. Uh, um, sorts out your job, doesn't it? Something occupation, or occupational. The generalized occupational aptitude test? Correct. Yeah! <laughs> General occupational aptitude test or something. Yes! I'm gonna give you that! Really? Yeah! Did Mike get that? He did. What? He did. <laughs> Damn it! Yeah, it's generalized, but you know, yeah, general, generalized. Fine. Occupational aptitude test. Yes! A that point. was some amazing detective work, <laughs> some amazing deduction. Oh, he, he worked it he, out. He sort of figured That's it out. That's cheat. Working it out is cheating. <laughs> you should just know it because you've played it a bunch. Come in, loosen up your tie. Have a drink or 
That's Magnolia, the club singer. You ask her where someone's gone at one point in the quest. You can romance her if you pass three speech checks. Or maybe just one more. It sounds familiar. But if you're searching for something to bring you comfort. You're like, hey, what's up? And she's like, no, no, no. And then you have to do it like three times. Huh? And then, because that's how seduction works, Jane, as I'm sure you know. <laughs> um, Ooh, well, I'm the one you're looking for. Is it Troy Baker? I'm thinking it must be a recognisable voice actress who I would know the name of. So... Well, hit me. Jennifer Hale. Hit me again. Tara Strong. Hit me again. Uh, Ashley Birch. Uh, Troy Baker. I've no idea, so Troy Baker. I mean, like, still percentage chance pretty high that I'll get it right. He's, he's got great range. Come on. Linda Carter. What, Wonder Woman? Yeah! What? I know! Oh! Wow! Oh my god! It's not, it's not There's horrible. nothing that Wonder Woman can't do. Literally nothing she oh can't my god. do. Yeah. Oh, I wish I'd known that. I had a massive crush on Linda Carter when I was a kid. Oh, that's a nice little bit of trivia. Oh. oh. It's a steak of something, right? Right. So... Half a point. Is that like mole rat meat? Char-grilled steak? Is it death claw meat? Charbroiled steak. It looks burnt, I would say. Is it burnt death claw meat? <laughs> Roasted steak. I'm going to give you one half point because it is a ribeye steak. Ribeye? What? Made from Brahmin meat. So it's right. actually proper cow meat. That does not look like any steak I've ever had. Might be a bit overcooked. Yeah, I think they've overdone it. Is that like Queen Myla meat or something? That is a sweet roll. Correct. Yeah. That's what a sweet roll looks like. Yeah, in Fallout. Oh, yeah, right. Remember how they looked in Skyrim? Yeah, they were little, little volca sugary volcano they things. They look delicious, right? Yeah. What? Mm. That's, that's what you get in Fallout. Yeah, right. The confectioners of the wasteland need to take a long, hard look at themselves. I would describe it as like a hockey puck drizzled with uh, icing. Maybe it originally looked like a Skyrim one and <laughs> yeah. got like nuked. Mashed flat and nuked, yeah. It's made on like a cooking station, so it's not just like a raw ingredient. What the hell kind of shape is that? So you're telling me that's a nutritious and delicious uh, waste Somewhat meal. nutritious and delicious. Radroach meat that's been cooked? Mm. Not a big chef in game then. Not really, no. I don't like to make things, I like to blow things up mainly. Is it like a mole rat thing? Mm. Do you want to know? Yeah, go on. Okay, it's a Mylert cake. So it's like a a Mylert cake. cake. Oh, yeah. man. Right, for bonus points, I know, chef I need them. Mike. Uh, name the ingredients of a Myler cake. Right. You're going to have to use your chef intuition, seeing as you've never cooked one. And you get a <laughs> quarter point for each because there's four ingredients. Myler meat? Yes. Oh, God. So, Myler meat? Yes, one quarter point. Um, no else? idea what the rest are. <laughs> Tato? No. No. Um, hub flour? No. Carrot? No. It's oil. Yeah. Razor grain, which is oh, like wheat, right? Yeah, wheat, which is right. like mutant wheat. Myelet meat, which you got, mm. and a myelet egg. Oh, oh yeah, to bind it, yeah. I guess. Yeah. yeah. Like a it's crab cookery. cake, yeah. yeah. Pretty sure that's jet. Is it jet? No. No, no, no. no, no, no I know no, what no. it is. If it's no. not jet, I know what it is. No, it's turbo. Oh, turbo. Turbo. Turbo and jet basically Close the same relative thing, aren't they? Jet. Right? Damn. Are you sure? Yes. Can you look at what Jet looks like? I... I can. Is that Jet? That is Jet. <laughs> Identify this care, Mandy. That's Jet. <laughs> Correct! <laughs> like, it looks point. exactly like Turbo. because no, Turbo's <laughs> attached to a can of hairspray. Oh, really? Yeah, Okay. Look. It's just someone's asthma inhaler. Yeah, it is basically, but souped up. Is it like a ceremonial sword from the invading Chinese forces? Yes. Right. Half a point. I think it's called General Jingwei's sword. Like, I don't know. Like, it's like an officer's sword, right? Of, of the, a Chinese army officer's sword. It's a, a Chinese officer's sword, but like a legendary variant. Half a point. It's yes. actually called General Chao's Revenge. General Zhao's sword. General someone's sword, right? Three quarter points. Okay. And let me explain <laughs> right. why three quarter. It's called General Chow's 
Revenge. Revenge. I think your guess is a little bit better, a little bit closer. Yeah. Because you said General Z Zhao. 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 It was quite I was, close. I was doing the original Chinese pronunciation. Yeah, and you yeah. got the rank. We both know how this has to end. So, you ready? So you remember what you do after that, and then you... I remember what I did to kill Kellogg, which was I shot him with a nuke. Yes. <laughs> at point blank range in an enclosed space. And it worked. Kill Kellogg. Mm -hmm. Go up in the lift. Loot everything. Go up in the lift. What happens next what is happens next? the shield heli carrier comes in and flies over. And then you spend half an hour trying to fire Fat Man nukes at it to see if you can get it to hit the shield heli carrier, but you can't. Another word for the shield hel heli carrier? The Brotherhood of Steel, murder blimp. We both know how this has to end. So. Do you remember having a fight I with I remember Kellogg? having a fight, I remember hiding under a desk and shooting at him. I would hide under a desk and sort of cry and let Nick Valentine shoot him. And then I would occasionally pop out and take a load of Psycho. And yell at him and then shoot him in the head. Uh, is this the bit where the, the Brotherhood of Steel come past in a massive, um, I always forget the name of them, Vertibird. They come by in a massive Vertibird and then you go, oh, the Brotherhood of Steel. I wonder what those guys are about. Half point. Half point? Uh, uh, and they, no, yeah, they oh. no, half point. What, okay, what is it? Because it's, it's the, 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 the Zeppelin. The, pri the just... Pridwin. Yeah, yeah right. It's, what I, like, it's like a helicopter, what I, Andy. Like I said, no. they come by in the Pridwin. No. And it's, can I have a point for knowing it's the Pridwin? No. <laughs> Damn it. But not Verti Vertibird's like a little thing. I said I always forget the name of it, and then I went Vertibird, but then that wasn't what I was thinking. I was thinking, Prid I was thinking oh. Pridwin. Deep into that darkness, peering. Right, let me add it up so we know what you got. Oh. The results are Mike, right. three and three quarter points. Okay. Andy, four and one quarter points. Oh yeah, that's right, Mike. Who is? The, I'm surprised I didn't. I did that. Yeah. Little better than Mike. Half like a considering point. Considering. Hundred hours was worth half a point. Yeah. Well, it was all questions about getting naked with your companions, which is not that something. Is my that is it. what he is well into. Thanks for watching this quiz about Fallout 4. If you enjoyed it and you want to watch another quiz about a different game, then we've got a couple of others. We've got So You Think You Know Black Ops, which is underneath me right now. You can go and watch us answer questions about Call of Duty Black Ops. Imagine that, how much fun that'll be. And over there, I'm we've sarcastic. got- I'm not being sarcastic. I'm not being sarcastic. It's good. It's Pitch fun. It. It's, it's good. It. You don't even have to like Black Ops to watch that. It's really good. And over there is uh, a better Lower. one. A there we go. <laughs> about about Tomb Raider. Do it right. Which is, yeah, sorry, there. Which is about Tomb Raider and lots of sorts of questions like what is Lara Croft's name? That wasn't one of them, but there'll be better questions than that. I don't Should remember. we celebrate your victory Maybe. by watching another video? Oh, yeah, that would be a good way. That's what how I want you to celebrate my victory. It would really mean a lot to me if you watch one of these other videos. And I think I deserve it after that excellent performance. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.